I'm going to measure the total of 32 inches of yarn. 12 plus 12 equals 24 plus 8 equals 32 inches. Now I'm going to make a slip knot. I'm leaving the yarn that is short to the front and the long side of the yarn is going to be to the back. The slip knot counts as one so I'm going to do the first one. Now I have two. Remember to place the long side of yarn over your index finger and then the other side of the yarn over your thumb and it will turn as a name shape like this. First, I'm placing the two needles inside the circle of the thumb, as you see here, and I grab the yarn from the index finger and just pull it through and let it go, as I had mentioned. It's so easy to cast on. Just remember that whatever yarn you have in the back is gonna be used more when you cast on. So always make sure to have the short side of yarn on the front and rotate it only if you feel that you have too much extra yarn and you don't want to end up with a long piece of yarn. That will have to be cut off after you are done casting on. I'm casting on the total of 42 stitches. And you see here, I'm going to have extra yarn, so I'm going to rotate it to the back, the short side, and continue casting on. I have finished casting on. I'm going to make a knot. For row one, first I'm going to knit seven. Remember to place the yarn to the back and over your index finger in order to knit. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now I'm gonna purl, so I'm placing the yarn over the needle. And I'm gonna do my first purl. One, two, three, Four, five, six, and seven. Now I'm gonna knit fourteen. Look how it shows the knitting and the purl. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Next, I'm going to purl seven. So place the yarn over one. Two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And last of all, it's to knit seven. One, two, 
थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स एंड सेवन On row two, I'm first going to knit one. So remember to place the yarn to the back in order to knit. Next, it's purl seven. Place the yarn over the needle in order to purl. So I here I have one, two, three, four. Five, six, and seven. Now I'm gonna knit seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And next is purl twelve. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Now I'm gonna knit seven. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, purl seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and last of all, just knit one. For row three, I'm going to place the yarn over the needle to purl two. One and two. I'm doing it slowly so you can see that it doesn't matter sometimes if you get it from this side or this other side. It all depends on the pattern. Further on, I will show you on episode three and four how to make the same style scarf with only purling or knitting so you can understand what I mean. Next is to knit seven. So there I have two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Then purl seven, one, two, three, Four, five, six, and seven. Sometimes it doesn't matter what side you do it from, as long as it doesn't twist. So I'm gonna do it from this side. So I have purled seven. Next is to knit ten. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now I will be proling seven. One, two, three, four, five. Six and seven. Next, knit seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Last of all, purl two. One and two.
to begin row 4, first you're going to knit 3, 1, 2, and 3. Next, purl 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. Next, I'm going to knit 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and next is going to be to purl 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, knit 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Next, I'm going to pro 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And last of all, I'm going to knit 3. 1, 2, and three. You see how it's starting to form its design? On row five, I'm going to start with purling four. So I'm going to place the yarn over the needle. One, two, three, And four. Now I'm going to knit seven. One, two, put the yarn under to knit three. And another mistake that we usually do is sometimes to twist it, so don't twist it like this. I'm gonna redo it again so now I have four with this one five six seven now I'm going to purl seven one two three four five six seven next I'm going to knit six one two three four five six now purl seven again one two three four five six and seven knit seven one two three four five six seven last of all pro four one two three and four For row six, I'm gonna first knit five. One, two, three, four, and five. Next, purl seven. One, two, three, four, five, six.
6 and 7 next I'm gonna knit 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 now pro 4 1 2 3 4 knit 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 now pro 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 last of all knit 5 1 2 3 4 and 5 I have finished row 6 for the last row I'm gonna purl 6 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 next I'm gonna knit 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 now pro 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 next knit 2 only 1 2 next pro 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 knit 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and last of all purl 6 and this is the end of the pattern and you're gonna repeat again after finishing this row you're gonna repeat from row 1 to 7 the end of the video I will be happy to share with you the pattern so you can go ahead and take a picture of it or print it however you would like I have repeated the pattern four more times it's up to you how long you want to knit your scarf thank you for watching the video don't forget to subscribe